so much. So, hey, ladies, how many hair appliances do you have at your home in your uh, bathroom there? Maybe blow dryers, curling irons, straighteners. We're always searching for the best one. Yeah, so this morning on Sunrise, Naomi Paskovitz is trying this thing. It's called the InStyler. It's a gadget you've probably seen on TV, but does it work? Right, does it work? Naomi tried it out with the stylist at Studio 2000 downtown. How many commercials have you seen on TV for products like this one promising to make your hair straighter or curlier, less frizz, more volume? We see them all the time, right? But do they work? This one is called the InStyler. And to test it out, we are with the experts here at Studio 2000. We've got Brooke Baker and our lovely model, Brandy. Brooke is our stylist today, and we are going to test this out. Have you ever tried one before? No, I haven't. It will be a first. All right, we'll have to see if it works. So here's what it looks like out of the box like a typical curling iron but with prongs on top. Taking sections about the size of the barrel and wrapping it around the insiler and combing it through, I feel like for um, longer hair it kind of seems to get stuck but it is smoothing nicely. It's pretty tangled in there. <laughs> yes, it is. Sorry. This is okay. <laughs> it doesn't hurt yet. It doesn't hurt. Okay, good. Someone with long hair might not be the best option. One thing I'm noticing is that it's getting stuck in the brush quite a bit. Yes. And her hair has a pretty smooth texture, so you wouldn't think that it would get stuck, but like I said, I think a lot of it has to do with the length. So overall, some good and bad with the InStyler, but our model Brandy here looks gorgeous, of course, and maybe try it out and let us know what you think.